just hate, but for cruelty against the Jewish people. And I would argue it's the deadliest day for Jews since the Holocaust. We are heading, as you know, to uh, Israel, and I'm going with a very simple and clear message on behalf of the This attack uh, was uh, a campaign of pure cruelty, not, not just hate, but pure cruelty against the Jewish people. And I would argue it's the deadliest day for Jews since the Holocaust. I think you've already figured it out. I refuse to be silent. I know you refuse to be silent as well. And uh, already we're... Uh, we're surging additional military assistance to the Israeli Defense Force, including ammunition, interceptors to replenish the Iron Dome, and we've moved the U.S. carrier fleet to the eastern Mediterranean, and we're sending more fighter jets there in that region. And made it clear, made it clear to the Iranians, be careful. We will be reiterating, reaffirming the very strong message that President Biden has delivered to any country or any party that might try to take advantage of this situation. And that message is don't. Uh, the President has deployed, as you know, uh, the world's largest aircraft carrier group to the region to make very clear our intent to deter anyone contemplating any further aggression uh, against Israel. We lost 22 Americans. That number could still go up, and it probably will. At the same time, we have a number of Americans who remain unaccounted. Uh, we are working very closely. If you like this video, then like, share and subscribe to Mirror Now.